Hey guys, it's me, Jaleesa, and welcome back to another vlog. If you're new, I love it if you subscribe and become a part of my YouTube family. And if you're returning, thank you guys so much for returning and always supporting me. I really do appreciate it. This is a continuation from my last vlog, so make sure you guys watch that. I will link it below. I'm headed to New York City to go to a modeling casting call. If you're new, I am a model and an actress. I'm also a foster and adoptive mama, so I had to hurry up and do my casting call today to go pick up my boys um, from school and my foster daughter so it was really quick i got there i tried on a bunch of outfits once i got to the studio and we did like a little mini photo shoot and that was the actual audition the photos that i did from um the audition um i came home because i was a guest speaker on a zoom event which was really fun um and that took about two hours this is after i picked up my boys from school and now this is the next day <laughs> All right, hey y'all. Good morning. I literally just woke up. <laughs> um, yesterday was my audition. Let me just take this off. Well, now I'm about to get in the shower. Yesterday was my audition. Um, I didn't vlog as much for it. Wait, Alexa, stop. Cause Alexa don't be listening these days, boy. Um, I did my audition yesterday. I said I was going to take you guys with me. I didn't vlog as much, but what I did was a reel for my Instagram that I'm going to post today. So um, follow me on Instagram at Jaleesa Graham and then you could see like the process. I think I just vlogged going to New York, um, but I didn't really vlog at my um, modeling audition. But I did do a like mini vlog for that. That's going to be on my Instagram later today. It's the next morning. So this is like a couple days vlog, y'all. <laughs> so today, I think I'm in the vlog today. So today I'm getting my boys lunch ready. Um, I'm about to wake them up. I'm about to take a quick shower and then pack their uh, snack and lunch. And then um, I'm going to just come back home edit some videos and then later i volunteer to do field day at gabe's school tomorrow and then i'm doing field day at um for next class next week so i'll probably take you guys with me to field day and then probably end up like that <laughs> but um make sure you guys like subscribe okay all right guys have a good day after his thing i'm gonna pick you guys up you want tissue get some in your class okay uh-oh, sorry. All right, Mojo, I'll see you on field day, okay? Okay, see you later. I'm going to pick you up early after his field day, okay? Say bye, Mojo. Bye. Say bye, Nick. Bye. <laughs> Didn't they seem so joyous in the morning, guys? <laughs> they were like, bye, bye. <laughs> but I just took the boys to school. Um, <laughs> now I'm going to... Um, take the baby to school. What happened to forever? Now we're not together. I know it's time you probably need a break to see if you would do whatever. I don't die together. But baby, know that I'm good either way. What happened to forever? Now we're not together. I know it's to target let me give y'all the haul now because i always say i'm gonna do it at home and i don't but side note i had the best shopping experience at target like i went into target i stopped at starbucks and got my mango dragon fruit refresher with lemonade with the berries you need everything to honestly make it taste good and then i got a ham and swiss croissant i usually either get a ham and swiss croissant or a ham and swiss panini the panini is just like on a harder bread but i like it the bread is good so this croissant but i went into the um god must know i need to have a good day because so when i went into the starbucks there's a lady that always works there and she kind of like says hi sometimes but not always but today she was super friendly she was like i haven't seen you where have you been and i was like girl i've been trying to stay out of target and then her <laughs> And the other lady that worked at Starbucks, they was laughing. And then we just started talking about like how when you work in retail, because I've worked in retail, like when you work in retail and you get a discount, but you use all your money <laughs> in that store. So they were, I know how they work at Starbucks and they get a discount like for Starbucks and Target. 
I was like, ladies, stay strong. Because I used to work at Old Navy and Ross. Where else did I work in retail? Years ago, I worked like in New York and Company. But when I was like really, really shopping, it was in Old Navy and Ross, y'all. Okay, and in Old Navy, I had a 50% off discount as an employee. And then in Ross, I think I had like a, I want, I don't know. I think I had a 20% off discount and Ross's prices are already low. And then there's certain weeks where it's like double discount where you get like 40% off. We used to be shopping our tails off. So if you work in retail, stay strong, child, because them them employee discounts are dangerous. And you're the you you work in a store, so you see everything, all the new merchandise that comes in. I used to spend all my money in the store that I worked in. They give me a paycheck, and I give it right back to them. <laughs> so me and the ladies were just having such a good conversation about that. And then I went um when I was checking out. The cashier was so sweet. She was like, your hair is so beautiful. She was like, you're so beautiful. Wow, you're so beautiful. And like, I don't know, it just like lift my spirits. Y'all be kind to people because I really needed like a little boost. And God sent them to just be so sweet to me today. The lady in the checkout, she was like, wow, you're so, you're so, you're just so beautiful. Like, wow, you do, you're doing an amazing, like, I don't know. She just was like inspiring me, saying nice things to me out of nowhere. Like, she was like, wow, you're just you know and I was like oh thank you I don't know like some people like are amazed by the things I can do with my arms so she was just like wow like you're just you're wow you do everything she was like you're beautiful like she was like don't let anyone tell you you ain't beautiful and I was like thank you sis thank you but it was just like I'm feeling good okay but let me and y'all I spent almost 70 okay I spent 170 dollars in Target but a hundred of it was formula but let me show you what the other 70 was I didn't even buy anything prices are ridiculous out here okay so i got six of these cans of formula for my foster daughter that was a hundred and like seven dollars or something because i think they're like 16 or 17 dollars each so that added up to like a hundred dollars okay i can understand that that's formula but 70 dollars on let me show you what I, what I got for 70 dollars. let me show you i got some kleenex um they were on clearance it was a dollar 43 i think they're like usually a, it's not even clearance y'all that's like 20 cents i think it's like a dollar 60 or maybe it's usually like a dollar 80 but these are the antiviral ones Ooh. so they have like um those little beads of like antibacteria in them i got how many did i get i got three of these they're a dollar 40 right let me tell you what's $70. What what added up to $70? So I got three of these. They're a dollar 40. So let's say a dollar 50 each. $3 for 50. Okay. That's four, that's under five dollars. I got this Tabitha Brown plate. Y'all know I modeled for Tabitha Brown's first clothing line when she first came out with Target. And then she had like a food line and now she has like a summer line. So it's like towels. I'm gonna go back and get some towels. Um she has like towels, plates, playing cards. Um, beach bags what else does she have um like serving dishes serving plates little summer cups and things like that um i bought a smaller plate last time so i got this one this is like i don't know how much it costs but i think it's like four dollars okay we up to like eight dollars we're under ten dollars how we got to 70 i don't know i got some wipes for the baby target brand okay i was trying to not to spend a lot this was, I don't know how much this was. <laughs> I got paper. Oh, you know why it costs a lot? I know why. Okay. I got toilet paper. I told y'all I need toilet paper. I got nail clippers for the baby because I lost her nail clippers. And I got a $4 thing of mascara, right? That's all I got in formula. But now I understand why, because I got a $25 gift card for Nicholas. Okay, now it makes sense. So this would have been, well, even then, it was like almost $80, 80 dollars 80 70 60 So this would have been $50 for just paper towels, this. There's something wrong, right, y'all? That ain't adding up. How was it so much money? Oh my goodness, I don't understand. I gotta look at my receipt, y'all. Because how is that? I mean, I understand the $25 gift card. So maybe this wasn't four dollars, y'all. I don't be checking prices, I just, but no, I do be checking prices. Oh, and I got oh wait wait wait, and I got a little thing of diapers for the baby. So maybe, but I got like the small pack that's like five dollars. The store brand because she already has some, but I just want to give that to her school for extra. I don't know. Y'all. 
I just don't understand why every time I go into Target and think I'm gonna buy a couple of things, $20, we at the $60, $70 mark. I understand the formula is um, added up to 100 because I got her six cans of formula, but dang, yeah. My little bit of coins, always. <laughs> Target just stay getting me, yo, every time, yo. Comment below if you go to Target. The, the cashier next to me, he was talking to the customer because he was like, oh, customers always say that. He was like, the top, the two top things he be hearing from customers at Target is I only came here for one thing and mind you, they have a whole cart of stuff or I forgot my bags. <laughs> it's like, that's what he always hears from a customer. Today, I did remember my bags, but I always forget my bags and I always have to uh, either, uh, you know what I do? How they get you, especially like in ShopRite, the bags, like they get, they'll, they have like these kind of, bags but they're like shop right bags at um shop right and they're only like 30 cent 35 cent so when you go up there and you have stuff and you didn't bring your bag you're like all right let me get a bag it's only 30 cent but if you do that every time you go to shop right you go on you add up and then um i have a ton of bags but i always forget them but today i didn't forget them but long story short i had a great trip in target y'all like the people in there were so nice to me god knew thank you jesus he knew that i just needed like i don't know that just really made my day see go to target more y'all it will lift your spirits <laughs> um it's later on i'm come i'm going now to gabe's field day Girl. all the parents are lined up for field day they had a bunch of games for the kids um i got an icy here because if you know my child gabe he does not like anything juice related whether it's regular juice frozen juice he don't like no ices he doesn't like um what does he like like consistency jello puddings yogurts anything like that so they gave him an icy and he was like no thanks so i ate it <laughs> and, yep an orange one <laughs> so now i'm walking around the front to pick him up and i'm also gonna pick up nicholas um while i'm here school is, it's only like 30 more minutes to school but i'm just gonna pick them up but it was really fun they had a lot of like uh fun games for the kids and the parents kind of just supported and chatted <laughs> but all right let me go get them and then maybe we'll go get the baby my arm is tired y'all <laughs> go to the park or get something to eat so how was field day hey nick oh. say hi to my vlog oh, help, me. help you do what to... you like your donuts mm -hmm. and gatorade it's hot right mm -hmm. now it's 77 degrees i thought it was going up to 71 degrees guys do a thumbnail with me everybody say cheese cheese I want Cheese. McDonald's. Alright. Alright. Let's go. Bye. You wanna say something to the people? Bye. Bye. It is 
later um we are waiting for gabe's um see the little gatorade bottle <laughs> we're waiting for his um coach to get here we're here a bit early and waiting for the rest of his team because they're about to have um flag football practice and then i think i'm gonna end the vlog here guys um what else did i do i just went to get the baby um and i actually went to the supermarket and then as i'm leaving uh my son texted me like oh nicholas was like oh i want hamburger helper as i'm leaving so after practice we'll just go um to the supermarket real quick um and get some hamburger helper and then we're gonna call it a night so come on guys let's watch gabriel do his practice but y'all you see gabe in the red <laughs> waiting we just waiting i'm sitting in a car waiting for the rest of his team to come but he is just <laughs> jumping 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 looking for his team probably <laughs>